Howdy folks, I hope everyone is doing well, and thank you to subscriber Dr. Lana Del Dre for this recommendation. Welcome to my review of Be Castled. Be Castled has a beautiful art style. If you enjoyed games like Northgard, Dice Kingdoms, or Against the Storm for their design, I think you'll fall in love with this universe. Be Castled is not perfect, and even though with what seems to be monthly updates, Be Castled has been in early access for three years. Take that how you will. So where is this game today? At the moment, Be Castled plays like a lot of the other games that I mentioned before, which is not a bad thing. You can easily figure out within the first 30 minutes to an hour how the game functions. I really enjoyed that this wasn't a complex game, but without management and progression, your walls will start to crumble. It struck the balance of being engaging without being punishing. Another factor that bolstered that notion, and if you watched my previous videos, is allowing the player to interact with the game itself before starting. This made me feel at ease learning the game because I tuned the game to more of my liking. When you start a run, you'll place down your castle. This is the start of your medieval dynasty. Congratulations. You'll have to be strategic in your placement. Having the high ground against invaders and grabbing resources early on is a must for any successful run. You'll be able to buy the first couple of tiles for cheap, but as you expand, you'll be spending more and more on resources, which was a fun game loop. There are a couple of resources you'll need. Wood, food, stone, and iron. For expansion and maintaining your capital. You'll also have access to a small but nice technology tree that allows you to build new buildings and enact certain interactions, like taxes and trade. I think there is a lot of room to add on to this technology tree. There are a lot of possibilities that I hope the developers choose to pursue. In the early game, you'll be balancing your resources, choosing whether to build or upgrade buildings or military. Yet after a certain point, when you gain the ability to trade resources for money, you won't be worrying too much about the resources themselves. The ability to buy resources or sell them made for an easier time, especially as the nightly raids got worse. It did take away from a dimension of the game that I thought was interesting, but later levels brought different challenges as well. As your city expands, you'll need to produce food for your citizens, which can be difficult sometimes. There are specific types of food production, wheat for wheat fields, farm for cows and sheep, but you'll need the tile producing those things to actually be able to use it. This was a really neat concept that Against the Storm uses, but again, after a while, you'll get access to pumpkins and beets, which do not require anything other than land. After those are unlocked, your food situation will never go south. I'm not saying that's a problem. Most games like this, you'll get to the point of becoming a literal god, but I think you'll get there a little too quick. I believe a larger tech tree would greatly help the progression of the game itself and add numerous fun mechanics to an already interesting game. Yet, even with all of this said, there is something special about Be Castled. Fighting off Night Raiders and hearing the music change while you see the sun coming up was really vivid and magical. Your town's growth feels organic. You're the one creating this fortress in the wilderness. It felt fitting for a king or queen. I loved all the little details in the animations. If you train your archers, those are your townsfolk training outside. Or while you fish, seeing your villagers talking had me feeling more connection to this game. Setting up towers and defenses felt important and rewarding. Upgrading my archers with fire arrows or shields for my spearmen had tangible effects aesthetically and in combat. Be Castled is relaxing without putting you to sleep. If you like any city builders or strategy base building games, I check Be Castled out. If you're hesitant on its long tenure and early access, maybe wait for it to go on sale. Anyways, I really enjoyed playing Be Castled and can easily pick it up and play for a couple of hours without hesitation. Thank you so much for watching. 
If you enjoyed this video, let me know by leaving a like, comment, or subscribing. And check out my other reviews. You might find something you like. And as always, see you next time.